Yo, hey everybody. Welcome to Mavi's Vibe. All right, so today we're going to be talking about Anatoria. You know, she's a fast rising Afro pop gospel artist who is already making waves. And trust me, in the next few years, this fire that this young lady is starting is gonna burn the world. Yep. So, I enjoyed preparing the story for you guys I'm talk, we're going to be talking about her origin her parents her siblings where she's from her her exploit in the music industry the voice and all of that you know what just stay tuned and you will find this story very interesting yes So many things you never knew about her you're gonna find out today all right let's go her full name being blessing anatoria chipata or chaitapa chitapa whatever is a zimbabwean born singer from russell hall Dudley. she was born on the 20th of march 2002 she's a singer a vocalist and she plays a few instruments like the guitar in 2020 chi tapa auditioned for the ninth series of the voice uk and joined Oli Mer's team after performing angels by ruby williams she was announced as the winner of the series Signing a contract with Iceland Records, she has two singles, That Love and Stay With Me. Now, Stay With Me was the first song I heard about her, from her, and I fell in love with that song. You know, oh, Baba God, will you stay with me? Oh, it was amazing. I tell you, it was, it was amazing. It's still amazing. All right, moving on. Blessing Anatoria is the daughter of Mr. and Mrs. Chitapa or Chai Tepa. I'll take that again. Just why, why can't I, you know, what's wrong with me? Why, why can't I feel confident? about myself pronouncing her Zimbabwean name or surname better still. Anyways, Anatoria is the daughter, the first daughter of Dr. Cleophas and Pastor Sarita Chitapa. If you are from Zimbabwe and you're watching this video, kindly forgive my pronunciation, okay? Her parents, Dr. Cleophas, and Pastor Sarita Cleo Sarita her parents Dr. Cleophas and Pastor Rita Chitapa are pastors at the Cornerstone Fellowship Church International in the UK. Yes, she's a pastor's child. Now Cornerstone Fellowship uh, is a church in West Bromwich. England. 
As a child, she was raised in the church around gospel music. Both of her parents, of course, are pastors. And so, most likely she was in the choir. And if she was in the choir, most likely she was a lead vocalist. And if she was a lead vocalist, then she has always, always, always been in the church. Now, about her siblings. Anatoria has two siblings. One is Sharon. The other is Dawn, David Dawn. Now, her brother, who is autistic, is the face of the David Dawn Foundation, which basically caters to autistic children. And her mom, Sarita, is, you know, the one sort of running it, you know. They do a lot of programs online. You can follow up and see what they do, raising awareness for autistic children and you know simply basically making the world a better place for them the singer is primarily known for being the winner of the voice uk in 2020 her self-titled anatoria tiktok account has gained over 230 thousand and three million likes for her singing, dancing, and comedy video. Yeah, it's good to know that she is also an amazing dancer. She's also an amazing dancer. The young lady, Blessed Chitapa, Anatoria, popularly known. Before her ascension in her singing career, she attended Dudley College of Technology in England. In 2021, she released her debut album, My Smile which has over 20,000 streams. She has also collaborated with several singers like Limo Blaze from Nigeria. Also, she was with Maverick City for a while. I don't know if she's still in Maverick City. some other collaborations that she has been involved with. Anatoria's sister, Sharon, is a psychologist. There isn't much about her on socials, but from what we can see, she's also into music. But Loki, I guess she hasn't found her path yet. Hopefully very soon we'll be hearing from her. All right. Mrs. Sarita is someone who is very supportive of her daughter and she's a minister of the gospel too. It's safe to say that Anatoria is probably what very, led very you to guide gospel, the church in the or, like, this year. religious family. The idea is because just to because provide you see them active in all their works. You see them active. active. Yeah, we have some yeah, throwback God. pictures God. of her in the choir with Why is others. And um, enjoy the video. Enjoy the video. We do not see results. The unfortunate part of the teaching on faith mm -hmm. is that sometimes we do not realize that everything should be accompanied by action. Mm. And what we do over and above our prayer and our sincerity is actually what delivers results in our right. lives. Mm -hmm. And so we put a special emphasis on action. 
so that people realize that the idea that you have prayed does not necessarily mean you are supposed to be inactive. You need to understand that for every commitment of faith, there must be action that is commensurate mm -hmm. with your faith. Prayer is its own role in terms of right. how God guides mm -hmm. what we do, but it does not replace and substitute our response in terms of commensurate action. So that's that. I'm sure you enjoyed this video. Kind of like, share, and subscribe, and tell your friends about us. I'll see you in the next video.